Hey, how's it going? My name is John and welcome to Fall Row. Hit that intro. All right, we are back with some more Digimon Survive. Let's go ahead and jump right into this. Um, where do we need to be? I think this is the place, right? So let's go ahead and go right into the deep woods and go talk to Aoi and see, see what's up. Aoi's not around here. I heard that she and Labramon take walks around here sometimes. Thought I'd run into them, but... Oh well. I had a question, but... Guess I'll ask later. Huh? Oh, there they are. Aoi and Labramon. Aoi looks kind of upset. Wonder what they're talking about. Oh, excuse me. Sorry. Hold on. Had to burp. Okay. <clears throat> I need to be stronger. More reliable. I've been thinking that a lot lately. But you're reliable already. I know you better than anyone, and that's what I think. No, it's... It's still not enough. I'm still not enough. Are you worried about being a burden to the others? You know that's not possible, right? Thanks for saying so, Labramon. Still, that's not what I'm worried about. Of course, I don't want to hold the others back or be a hassle. But I'd like to become more reliable for myself, that's all. I want to be someone who can protect anyone. Oh, I think that sounds wonderful, Owie. Hey, I want to help, okay? Go ahead and ask me about anything. I will. Thanks, Labramon. It's kind of strange. Strange? What is? What is? No matter how worried or depressed I get, walking in these woods with you always clears my head. If it helps you, I'll walk with you as much as you want, Allie. <laughs> Thank you, really. I see. Though so Allie's always been discussing her worries with Labramon on these walks. Be that as it may, she's trying her best to change as well. I'd better do the same. Now's not the time to butt in with my questions. I'll just sneak away for now. What? Who's there? What the? Ah, shoot, they noticed me. Ah, well, I'll just come out and explain what... Oh no! Was that an enemy? Man, they've never shown up here before. Calm down, Owie, leave this to me. I won't let anyone lay a finger on you. Every time we stay hidden, it's a bad thing. Maybe we should stop doing it. Are you alright, right, Labramon? Kind of. But if I'm honest, I don't think I can win this one. Labramon. I hate to admit it, but... I agree. You're always working so hard to protect me and the others. But power that only protects isn't enough for us to stand up to this guy. I want more. More power. Not just to protect, but to overpower. It's frustrating, but it's true. We need more power. Power to defeat our enemies. I want to be more than a damsel in distress. I want to defend everyone. And to do that, I need power. Oh, shit. Yeah, yeah, we get it. Your strength and resolve and obsession for power is transforming Labramont. We get it. Let's see the transformation, though. What do we get? What the- wait, what the fuck? What is this? Oh, shit! It's Lord Aethelstan. <laughs> Lord Aethelstan and Bradley, if they mix together, I guess. So Soborusuma. Cerberusman. Super. Cerberusman. Why? That's hard to say. What's happening? Sorry for the wait, Aoi. Don't worry, I won't let you down again. Now watch, and I'll show you what it's like to have all the power you were hoping for. That's a pretty dope transformation. Let's get it! 
Fight! 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 God damn! Annihilated them. Are you... Labramon? Not anymore. My name is Subaru Simon. It's the only way I can think of to pronounce that that is not a total mouthful. The strength of your resolve transformed me. The strength of my resolve? So those long claws, those fangs, are they the result of the strength I dreamed up? Does my appearance frighten you? Well, a little, but it's not your body that scares me. It's that sharp monstrous shape of the power I craved. Can I truly muster, master such power? Don't be afraid. As long as your heart is true, even great power will not go astray. You can handle this, Aoi. I believe in you. Saburusama. You're right. Power will hurt people indiscriminately if used properly. I'll do what I can to live up to your faith, so please stay by my side. Sure, that's my line. Owie, it seems she's taken a big step forward. I can't fall behind. Man, I'm so appreciative of that comment that told me, like, by the way, <laughs> the Deep Woods have lore bits and transformations you can unlock. I can't believe I skipped over so many of them already, probably. That irritates me to no end. Thanks for the update, Agamon. I would definitely couldn't have told myself that. I definitely wouldn't have noticed. So there's just all kinds of murals all over the place. Thank God we're in this world. The other one, this entire place has been caved in, so we don't exactly have the information we need. Most important thing, I guess, or not? First level, sure. Start from the beginning. We already knew that, didn't we? この壁画を信じるならそういうことになる。注目すべきはここ。ミコだ。他に比べて明らかに詳細に描かれている。古来よりミコは神の代弁者としての側面もあった。おそらく獣神と人間をつなぐ存在だったんだろうね。獣神と人間をつなぐ。ミコ。そしてこの壁画。Vicious monsters on a rampage or vicious monsters defending their town. These are all interpretations. We don't know if any of this is true. Oh, that's kind of interesting. So the reason why a Cerberus Mon would exist is because Cerberus... Or the reason why Cerberus exists is because Cerberus Mon exists, I guess, and was like used as inspiration for the story of Cerberus. That's kind of interesting. Huh. Why would I not look? What? 
made the info. At least, judging on these shrines, the first two we know about just by personal experience. The portals or the darkness between them? Considering she said it was an ability passed down in her family, yeah, that would make sense. I wonder if the power passed down to anybody while she was in the other world in her bloodline, or is she the last of her bloodline, or uh, do the powers not transfer over because she's not dead yet? Huh. I'm also realizing now that when Yuki went over to our world, she was essentially caught in like the story of Captain America, where she's like was in the 40s or 50s or whatever, and then came all the way to modern time and was like, what the fuck? You know what I mean? Like, I have huge Captain America energy. You know what's weird? These murals, they make me think of the fifth element. I grew up watching that movie so much because it was one of my mom's favorite movies. And for some reason, the opening, where they're like in Egypt and they're like clearing out the like hieroglyphs and stuff, it's just like burned into my brain. So much of that movie is actually burned into my brain. Okay, final thing. Give me new information, please. Now's as good a time as any, Professor. Step out of the way. What the fuck? Oh, this is bad. It looks like they're being whipped around in a storm, so... I assume some kind of storm is coming? それぞれの壁画には繋がりがあるようにも思えるのだが、そうすると時系列がどうなっているのか。あの、教授。ああ、すまない。思考に没頭してしまった。次の壁画に移ろう。とはいえだ、この壁画はあまりに謎が多い。
she was stuck here. We know all this. That was where they lived. Like, is it have is Takuma that thick that he hasn't pieced that together by now? The fuck? So are these like actual texts that we're getting in real life then? Oh, it was all in Japanese. I can't read any of that. I love it when visual novels actually take the time. Like this one, they've taken a lot of time to add a lot of unnecessary details like color lighting the fucking uh, portraits so they're accurate to the time of day or the locations they're in and stuff, which I appreciate a lot, but it annoys me when they're like, let's do an English release and then not change any of the Japanese to English when it's on like a picture like that. Like I understand it to some extent, but also there's plenty of games that take the extra step to do that, and I appreciate it every time. Because I'm supposed to know what they're reading. The professor's intriguing words, and now this garbled text? Something big might be going down here, but man, I honestly can't tell what. Can anybody? Does anybody ever know what's happening around here? I wondered if I could have held on this long myself. Well, no point in worrying about it. Best focus on the task at hand. Hey, Minoru! How goes it, buddy? I think I talked to everyone. みんなが。Is it really that hard to talk about what's going on with her? I want to ask him about it somehow, but Oh. Let's ask him straight. He's a straight enough shooter, I guess. You're my best friend, Minoru. I hope you would be honest with me. Oh god, of course. Interrupted at the most inopportune time, because of course we would be. Do they, like, have a cowbell as an alarm system? What do you mean we're late? Was there a scheduled time we were supposed to meet? Oh, did they turn her evil? Of course. Well, this is bad. She was gone for like a matter of minutes. We came at the same time. What the fuck? 
for a few days now? So she arrived earlier than I did then. Somehow. What the fuck? I guess we're going for it. Jesus. Get. Get them in there. Just so we can get them a little level up. I'm gonna do this battle and then. Well, I'm gonna quote unquote do this battle. And then I'll probably end the video after that. Let's go, brother. We got this. We just have to annihilate all of them. They barely do any damage. We should be fine. Ooh! Hit two for one. I didn't even know you could do that in this game. Hell yeah. Oh, they skipped that. Oh, they skipped that turn. That sucks. While this battle's going on, uh, I just want to say thank you for taking the time to check out this video. I appreciate it. I hope you're having a good day. Go ahead and leave a comment down below and let me know like how your day is going, what your plans have been lately. Like, Catch me up on your life a little bit, you know? I'd love to hear from you guys. You could also join the Discord in the description if you want, and we can actually like have a conversation. That'd be kind of cool. I'll be honest, the Discord isn't as active as it should be, because there's just not a lot of people in there at the moment, but... Yeah, I'd appreciate you guys taking the time to, like, go in there, check it out, say hi, things like that. This fight's taking a bit, huh? attack was so clutch that was great shit is that the first time i've heard a curse word in this game that wasn't from me i like the the idea of curse words because it's like it's it's like giving them so much more power than they deserve. They're just words, but the idea of them being curse words is so funny to me. Like you could be like, "Fuck you," and then that's gonna like cause like indiscriminate harm on somebody by saying that. Like it's so funny to me the idea of like I'll just curse them real quick and then be like, "You fucking shit piece of cunt" or whatever. Like the just cursing at people and they just like. <laughs> debuffing them and taking HP off and shit. Like, that'd be so funny to me. Mm. 
たを見誤る Well, we did it, I guess. I don't feel great about it, but we did it. Got a couple of level ups for the boys. Well, now. Well, now, nothing. Seems like we're gonna find out what happens in the next episode. So. I'm going to leave this video off here. Thanks for stopping by. Really appreciate it. And I hope I see you in the next one. Later. I mean, I mean, we just trying to chill. We say things like follow your heart.